All right, folks, we're going to go through the 29BH Jayco White Hop. Very nice unit, good colors. Got the outside kitchen. This fridge is AC only, so you have to be plugged in for that. Got some step lightings, it turns blue, very nice. Outside grill, be careful pulling on this, it's very sharp. Use your tabs, pull it open. I re recommend a copper grill pad on them, keep them clean. Steps, just make sure it's down on the threshold. When you do your door, just make sure when you pull it, it don't bind up here. If it does, pull it out. You have adjustment pins on each side. And you just make sure it's low to the ground. You got the nice LEDs, electric awning. This is not a weather guard or wind guard. It's light rain. You can actually pull these arms down for rain runoff. Put them back in shape when you pull it in. Takes the wrinkles out. Put it away at night. You'll have it in the morning. Wind is your enemy on that. Got the nice outside speakers, stove top drill, venting. Thumb tab that open when you're doing bacon or fish. Water heater is gas and electric. So the little switch on the bottom left hand side is electric. Just make sure you have water in it. All this can get wet. You got a gas and electric reset buttons. Do that, make sure, and then you can hit your electric side. And if you double up your gas and electric, it'll recover faster, give you endless hot water. Very nice rims. Mud dauber screens are recommended for the exhaust. Just keep things out of it. It's the only thing on the unit I'm going to recommend. Fresh water fill. You just set the hose in, begin filling. You'll have a LED lights, which I'll show you in a minute. And then drain is underneath. So very nice. I leave that open so it don't get stagnant and moldy power and cable for TV another door for access you got the table in this one push button lights your front lights are here power wash and hose and both cranks and a gas line for the grill one of the cranks the smaller ones for this if you need to use it regulator for the LP just make sure whatever side this is pointing at is the tank you're on so when you're done flip it over it gives you time to fill Brand new battery, two full tanks. Really cool with the lights, that's that switch. Battery disconnect. Use that if you're not using the unit. It'll keep the battery up so when you come back, it'll be fully charged. Keep it plugged in or it charges it behind the truck. Sewer hose, 110 adapter, no air on the 110. Very nice, good clean unit. More storage there. Caution, do not put a hose to this one unless you pull the black tank. You got grays and grays. You got a uh, kitchen, shower, and toilet. So when you hook a hose up, make sure that's pulled. This is your city water that gives you full time power from the hose from the park of your house. Hot and cold outside shower. Cable satellite hookup, power cord, sewer hose in the bumper. Got camera capability sold separate by Furion. Spare tire, don't ever jack on the axles, frame only. The LED lights I was telling you about. Actually, yours is on a gauge system. Very nice. Just scroll through. You can select. You got your lightings on this too. Very nice. You can actually pair a device to it. There's your grays, they'll just grow. When you're filling your fresh water, blacks, things like that. YouTube is very good. You can go through YouTube to get more information and you'll have manuals. You got lighting, security light, awnings. You'll either use the water heater and electric or the fireplace. So I see uh, when you're on 110 or when you're plugged in. 30 amp. GFI reset button. Uh, make sure that's pushed in every time you're plugged in. You got your LPCO detector fire extinguisher and a smoke detector all your safeties very nice with the bunks nice roomy bathroom on that very nice really like the LED lights nice and bright massage and heat for the chairs which is really cool USB ports lighting good storage storage under the bed very nice push your one button once 
Ooh, and this one I don't know. Probably because I have gloves on, it won't work. But they'll turn blue, you hold it, it'll turn white. Cable set up for the TV. Make sure your door is latched for travel. Got the big screen TV, a DVD, CD player. Fireplace will throw out heat to heat the unit when you're plugged in. You have to be plugged in for AC outlets, TV, microwave, fireplace. Fuse box, breaker box center, so if anything's going wrong, go to that first. Refrigerators are very nice on these. This swings this way, very nice. Temperature, all DC fridge. Very, very nice, some new products. That is a knife holder in the back. This thing will light up, which is really cool. Um, use your sparker for the top as needed. If you're doing the oven, you have to hold the button in using your sparker. I use that for a little window. Let it get hot and then use it as needed. Takes a minute sometimes on them. Get the nice faucet. Overhead fan and light, microwave. Keys for the unit hanging at the faucet, and of course you'll have your manuals and all your remotes in here because it is solar capable. They give you the cord. Well, I hope that's helpful, folks. Kind of go through it. Uh, YouTube, like I says, very good. You can always call us at all seasons. We'll give you good information. But thank you for shopping at all seasons. Have a great day.